in this first video I'll give you the instruction to how to how to install Apache server in your uh, PC and make it uh, and use it as a local host so here you can see this is ZAMP, this is MAMP, this is LAMP and this is WAMP so you can download any of it uh, if you are using uh, Windows you can download this MAMP uh, uh, WAMP sorry and if you are using Linux you can download this LAMP and you, if you are using uh, Mac OS which is Apple you can use this MAMP or you can go for this jump I will go for this jump the reason uh, behind uh, using XAMPP is that XAMPP has a support for uh, Mac OS, uh, Linux and Windows uh, Windows. so why not to use XAMPP and um, so uh, to, uh, we have to download the XAMPP file and this is the uh, this is the link I will put this link in the description so you can download this uh, link uh, here you can find all the XAMPP and XAMPP for Windows here if you are using linux you can use them for uh, linux and um, if you are using mac you can use os x them uh, for os x so let's just start it um this is uh i, I am using windows so i'm going to uh, download these and here you can see this is the psv support of this file and all of it is 32 bit and i'm going to download these um uh, php uh, which is support for uh, php 7.2.2 and just down, click download and just download the here you can see uh, the installation is completed and and we want to uh, open our ZAMP and so I'm going to t uh, keep the tick uh, the sign mark here and uh, let's just finish it so this is for the language and this is German and this is US. I'm going to open the US. So this is the control panel of our Jam server and Jam not Jam server Jam uh, program sorry. And uh, here uh, this is the Apache server and this is a MySQL our database management system or database whatever you want to call it. You can call it and let's just start our Apache server. So my Apache server is running and this is uh, start my school server my school database sorry so um, uh, my apache server is uh, running and my my school is connected so let's go to the panel uh, let's go let's test if if our, uh, if we successfully install this xamp in our pc so just here in, in the address bus open your favorite browser and the status light of uh, sorry local host and if you write the local host if you press enter you will find this page will arrive and if this page is arrived so your jump is uh, connected successfully Sometimes so when you try to open this Apache server, like here, I, if I click this start, it will start. But uh, sometimes the port uh, 443 is blocked. So if you uh, try to start the server, it will not start. So wh what will do when uh, this Apache server is not start? So uh, here you have to go to this config file and Apache the Apache HTTP D dot config file. Open this file and here just I uh, search 80 find 80 and uh, here you can find this um this port uh, this uh apache server is listening 80 port so here just write 8080 and find next and here's the server server local list it put 8080 here and closed it and save it i'm putting control s or you can just say that and after after that you have to open the config file again and here you have to change this HTTPD SSL.config open this and search for 443 and here you can uh, here you see this uh, the, this port is uh, uh, 443 port is listening so something uh, is blocking this port so just put another 3 here and save it so so if I start the Apache server 
so uh, it will uh, start uh, if you change the server so let us just give another try so here i have uh, in previously i have uh, we have give localhost slash dashboard and it will give us this pair uh, this space just uh, now just give the uh, refresh here so you will see this space will not occur because uh, this port is uh, we give 8080 for this uh, listening port so write 8080 here dashboard so if you give 8080 here uh, this space will uh, uh, appear so uh, if you change this port uh, from here you have to give the port here to work with it 